Hey there, this is June from Zeppelin. Hope you're having fun with the new spacing feature and are collaborating better with your team. Today, let's go over some spacing pro tips. Tip number one, local versus global style guides. Most of the time, you want to use spacing tokens in your global style guides to propagate across all your projects. Zeppelin makes that super simple. Let's go over to a workspace level and we can hit the style guide button on the top. And here in your style guides, you can set your global style tokens for all your projects. Sometimes you may have another set of spacing for a different project within your workspace. You can do that pretty easily in Zeppelin. Let's go over to my web project. I can hit the style guide tab on the top and you can set your local spacing tokens here. All right, for tip number two, we have single spacing token. If you define spacing on a single base value, Zeppelin supports that too. Let's head over to a web project and click into the spacing section. Here, let's set a single spacing token of six. Now, when I go into this guide screen, you can see that Zeppelin will show spacing in multiples of your base token name. Next, we have tip number three, download platform specific style sheets. This is a feature that will help developers start using spacing tokens right away. When I go over to this extensions panel on the right, you can download a platform specific style sheet that is tailored to your project. In this example, we have the CSS extension enabled, but you can also get SAS, Stylus for web, or even Swift or XML snippets for iOS and Android. For tip number four, we have Markdown. Markdown makes it easy and clean to share all types of documentation and Zeppelin fully supports Markdown in the spacing description section. Here in VS Code is a sample documentation that I've been working on that shows some of the most used capabilities of Markdown. Now I can simply copy this and paste it in the description section. It is now much easier to read and edit compared to traditional plain text. Tip number five, new spacing sections. Designers often use two spacing scales, one for components and the other for layout spacing. Zeppelin supports multiple spacing scales to fit your needs. Let's go over to a style guide tab in our web project and here, notice that I can create different sections and scale to your team's unique needs. And lastly, we have tip number six, colors. On the spacing page, if you click on the color boxes, You'll also have the option to change the overlay color that provide the best color palette for your designs. One popular use case that we have already seen is setting the spacing section to one color and the layout in another. Now when I go back into the guide screen, you can easily see what is layout and what is spacing. Hope you found this helpful. Please let us know any feedback on spacing in the comments below. Take care and see you in the next video.